Hi everybody, this is Kim. In this video, I'm gonna show you some numerical examples with uh, various uh, computer programming codes that I have developed. Uh, let's start by the method of gradient projection, and I'm gonna show, uh, solve you the problem uh, that we that I uploaded uh, entitled Mixed, Mixed Integer Nonlinear Programming Program and I'm going just to, to solve the first iteration, the starting initial relax continuous uh, solution. So I'm just writing the quadratic function, now the, the linear terms of this function, just posting there the square function, an hypersphere little displays. We try to minimize, we got five variables, zero quality constraints, and four greater or equal and four less or equal. I'm gonna use the Armijo search this time. The starting feasible point, I uh, used uh, the solution of a simplex, maximizing a unitary vector subject to the constraints. So just plug in the constraints, starting by greater or equal. There are four of them of this type. And, and now the less or equal to constraints, again uh, four constraints, and just the last row, okay, and now the right hand side terms of the greater or equals, and the right hand side terms of the less or equal to. So now we are going to see the solution is that, can be different 58 iterations, the first three constraints are tight, and the multiplier is positive, so everything is okay. I'm gonna solve another another example. The example that I solved uh, in the sequential quadratic programming uh, video entitled in this way, sequential quadratic programming. If you remember, the objective function was kind sort of exponential mixed with a quadratic term for the x2 variable. We try to minimize this subject to linear constraints also and two less or equal constraints. Upper number of iterations, 25, and I'm going to use the dichotomy search this time. Two, two, feasible points starting, and the constraints, and the right-hand sides, six and five. So the solution, zero, zero, two iterations, and the multiplier is positive. Now I'm gonna use a different approach, uh, reduced gradient method, Gener uh, generalized reduced gradient this time. I'm gonna solve the problem that we did in the video entitled reduced, gra reduced gradient method. You, this, this is already posted, the function and the constraints. In this case, the constraints are nonlinear. So 25 iterations starting in the one one point. This is the tableau because I'm using kind of a simplex. The point is infeasible, so we uh, use the approximation method and now you can see the results, the results that we obtained in that video. Okay, that's all. Many thanks for your attention. Bye bye.